this is the continuation of the previous tutorial guys please check the previous part video from the i button in the top right corner or else you can check the description where the link will be updated or else you can go to my channel playlist and find the previous part in this video on the in the extract of command uh, what we have is uh, region of face body and mirror body is left so i'm just going to take the region of faces in the last so i'll explain you body so as the name suggests the body so whatever the feature body is there you can just extract them and you can select here and you can extract and this feature is different so it is not selecting this body so this is completely different uh, body if you want to select you can just select this and we have an option two options over here one feature for all bodies so if you select too many features or too many bodies and you can uh, select this option and if you click ok and single body will be created suppose if you want a uh, different different bodies for a uh, different uh, um, features so you can just go to here and uh, select these two bodies and here is a separate feature for each bodies and if you click ok and there will be two extracted bodies you can see here this is different and this is different so this is how with this uh, extract body works guys and uh, also you can he see here there is a copy thread option so if there are any threads existing inside the body uh, if you want to copy them you can just uh, select this and uh, copy it so in this model i don't have any threads in this model so i cannot able to show you uh, next we have is a mirror body so we have an uh, you know um, the body here if you want to make a body with a mirror uh, so you can use this option so i'm just going to select this body as you can see here this is the body and select a mirror plane and this is my mirror plane so as soon as you click uh, okay as you can see here mirror of this body will be extracted over here if this is associative then uh, whatever the model here it will be changed uh, it will be acted on this as well so suppose for example if this is the body and i'm just going to extend this click ok so as soon as we click ok as you can see this is the associative of uh, uh, this component this feature is associative of this one so as soon as you extend this uh, this mirror body is, will also be extending as i said you the extract geometry will also be having a region of faces here so in order to explain this i have made a simple model here so i'm just going to explain you how this works so for example in the region of faces we have a seed face and boundary faces so seed face is the one from which you can uh, able to you know extract the geometry and the boundary faces will be suppose if i give this as a boundary so whatever the uh, you know faces that are connecting to seed face suppose this face is connecting to seed face and this is the boundary so you know it means that the uh, extracted body will be having this cone as well as the upper body so as soon as you click ok as you can see here so since this is our uh, you know uh, the top of this uh, extracted will be our uh, boundary so uh, because of that reason is it is not extracted this body suppose if you want to extract this body uh, in the region of faces you need to select this as a boundary so i'll just show you how that works so let me go again to extract feature and here is the uh, the seed face and I, if i'm say, going to select this as a boundary and until this uh, surface the body faces will be extracted so i'm just going to select this as a you know the boundary faces and this uh, options will remain same and as soon as you click ok until this body uh, you can see here until this the surface will be extracted so this is the end of the extract uh, geometry command guys i think uh, you understand it better please subscribe to my channel and hit the like button as well as share my videos thank you